hello bro so i'm gonna tell you what questions i am learning like this is the cheat code and i'll tell you bro like i can't learn all these stuffs because i'll start today maybe tonight that's why i'm gonna learn only three questions which are likely to come in i mean you know in the exams so now uh, bro this question mention its characteristics in first module this one bro very sure this question will come and they will they might ask about physical and logical designs or these two separately so you know what this physical and logical design is about i'll tell you like for physical design there are like four layers bro and those four layers also like very very basic knowledge bro very common we can learn about this and logical design it's about functional block communication and rest api i'm going to learn rest api properly and for these two i learn just the diagrams and then i'll write something this is all that i've thought firstly rule number 1 rule number 1 learn the freaking diagrams learn diagrams bro because you can just draw this is all about diagrams bro everything here is about diagrams just write the diagrams and then just write some story related to these diagrams using the same keywords in your answers that's it and then this is the first module ka you know answers that i wrote in order to keep in my mind the applications very basic one the major characteristics and then the functional block diagram with this diagram i'll explain and then communication models only four communication models rest api ka communication thing and then these two are optional again you can just take a screenshot of this maybe like you know i'll put this in the drive okay and then this is for second module i can't learn all the studying all these each and every single textbook line it's hard bro that's why i've written keywords from this textbook so that i can remember easily and in second module i'll tell you there is high chance that they'll give something some question related to machine to machine to machine okay and then net this thing and then yang these three three questions related to these three topics are like 90% they will give it bro so i thought i learn everything about machine to machine and then difference between iot to m to m m to m it depends if we have time and then this question will learn and this question will learn and this entire module has some code from yang part bro so I've, i'm learning only the theory part for this and code part i'm not learning code part not only for this for anything i'm not learning like i can't i can't learn that i can't learn that shit bro humans can't read it bro like anyways and then need for iot system design all the questions that are marked in red i'm going to learn that and this is the you know mind map it's like a mind map everything about m to m and about stn only three points that's why i wrote and need for iot system design and these two okay so apart from this i'm telling you this is like you know i i am giving all these questions so that everybody can learn but i am giving only these few two or three questions per module i'm just telling you that i am going to learn that thing because i trust myself if you also trust me then you can learn definitely why not and then third module pro third module and fourth module is the easiest i thought it is difficult but these two are the most easiest bro they have two case studies like one is weather monitoring other is home automation right yeah other is home automation one is weather and other one is home automation bro for this for these two case studies and for all the case studies in every single module almost all the diagrams are same bro like 
द टाइप ऑफ दीज डायग्राम्स आर लाइक ऑलमोस्ट सेम दिस दो इट्स इट्स द सेम फॉर मेजॉरिटी ऑफ द क्वेश्चन्स ओके सो python they will ask they will ask that is a fact that we have to keep in mind they will ask a lot of stuff about python or at least two questions about python and one or two question from this part and one or two question from this part see we can't completely predict the question paper like we did for bda because that was three credit subject this is three or four i don't know bro this is four credit subject bro so they may give three questions or three questions and first two they may give with first half part first half part and the second half part of the module second half part of the module or they may give just two questions and they may give this first half part second half part first half part second. it it could be like anything that's why it's not recommendable to learn only python or only this much learn two from learn two from the normal thing and one question from python okay so for this i have given the notes as well look at this weather monitoring i'm going to study this pro it is all about diagrams i'll just draw the diagram and i'll just explain whatever that's there in the diagram okay and home automation i've made it even smaller because it's all about basic explanation with the diagram that's why this thing i'll see if i have time and python data types i'll learn bro what in third module i've only written this much about python like this is the only stuff i've written about python data structures and loops so these two i'll learn if they are giving a question related to these two i'll write or else other part functions and all it's like way too lengthy if they ask for 10 marks then like only for two marks i can write so it's better to not write so it's better to not learn so i'm learning only these two bro look at this and then i'll tell you about fourth module again same high chances this first question will be there and they will ask about either parking or irrigation this is the last part of this particular module so they might ask about either smart parking or smart irrig irrigation bro so learn both just learn both in general so that you can write some stories there okay and then python program for blinking led this is the only python program that i'm going to learn in this entire iot subject this is the only python program i'm going to learn rest all other stuff i can't bro and components of raspberry pi it is left to us like again in the end we'll see if we have time okay and then fifth module they will definitely ask a question about this topic so i thought some i thought i'll learn some something in like you know i learn in such a way that i learn about topics bro like one topic like oz i i'll learn about that topic so that no matter what question they will give i'll write the same answer i don't know that is all i can do maximum so i i learn i learn about map reduce this fifth module is entirely about bda bro whatever we learned for bda it's the same thing so like you know components of apache spark we've learned hadoop we've learned map produce we have learned yang also i mean yarn also but it's left to us these three questions i'll mainly learn and about this topic i'll learn so this is all i'm learning there are like these many architectures i can't learn all of these out of these many architectures they'll give only one bro i'm pretty sure they'll give only one so just to write only one i can't learn all of these so i'll skip this question and write the or option this is what i've thought and this is the fourth module intrusion detection ka diagram and for diagrams as well listen and for diagrams as well for everything i'm going to write only process specification information model and service specification there is no way like i will not write that uh domain model bro domain model ka diagram i can't write it it's too huge i'll just write these three i'll fill up all the pages with diagrams and some theory related to these diagrams that's it this is all i can do to pass okay bye bye